What's up guys, Trizzle Trey with Triz Tech and Electronics. Today we're back with another comparison between the late 2011 model MacBook Pro and the new 2012 Retina MacBook Pro. This time we are going to be doing some benchmark tests with a program called Geekbench. We're going to start off with the 2011 model as we did last night. We're going to go into the launch pad, hit Geekbench, open it up, pick six, the 64-bit processor, since that's what it is, hit run benchmarks. Now I'm not going to make you guys sit through all of this like I did last night. I'm going to run it to about 5 seconds and then skip ahead. So as you can see the benchmark through Geekbench score is 10,268 with the stock 2011 15 inch MacBook Pro. That's not a bad score at all and it is definitely a beast. But check out the Retina. It's just unbelievable. So we're back here with the Retina now uh, taking a look at the outside. We're going to do the exact same thing that we just did with the uh, 2011 model. We're going to zoom right in, open up the launch pad, open up Geekbench, pick this 64-bit uh, system as we did with the other computer, and hit Run Benchmarks. Now I'm also going to run this to 5 seconds again so you guys don't have to sit through that boringness again. So here we are, it is 13,135, so it's almost 3,000 uh, points higher than the 2011 model. Uh, here they are sitting right next to each other, um, shows you their scores. As it says here, if you have not done so yet, definitely subscribe to the channel. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up, and I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace.